It is a story of perseverance in the face of tragedy. Dane Placco introducing us to a teenager overcoming all the odds. 16-year-old Yohanatan Levy is back in Chicago playing ping pong, which in itself is something of a miracle. During Levy's birth in Chicago, his skull was crushed by forceps used during delivery, leading to a host of medical disabilities, including partial paralysis of the left side of his body. Uh, you see the eye, le air, hand, and leg, so it's weaker than the right side of my body. Mm -hmm. And yeah, but I'm not uh, giving up. I'm all the time working hard. And At six, he and his family moved to Israel, where he eventually began playing table tennis. He also became heavily involved in Israel Parasport, an organization headquartered in Northfield that provides sports and recreational opportunities to hundreds of kids with disabilities in Israel. This week, he and another disabled athlete, 10-year-old Omer Gado, are putting on exhibitions and raising money in the Chicago area for their facility in Israel. The only thing that you need to come to the center is a physical disability. We have uh, Christian Arabs, Muslim Arabs, Bedouins, Jews. Our, our competitive teams are made up of everybody. We check politics at the door, and we're really all about just being the best person you could be. Now, Johanna Ten has become so good at table tennis, he has his eyes set on the 2028 Paralympic Games in Los Angeles. When you do something that you like and you love with this, so you feel good, and I really am, and I'm working hard to represent my country and the sports center at the 2028 Olympics in Los Angeles. Also here today, attorney Steve Levin, who won the medical malpractice case following Johanna Tan's botched birth and saw him for the first time in years. If you look at what he was like then and you compare it to what it is now, it's honestly, I would say in my professional career, one of the most amazing things I have ever seen and gratifying and heartwarming. And the Israel Parasport athletes will be heading to New York in a couple of days for more fundraising, money that is desperately needed with the growing number of casualties of war in the Middle East. In River North, Dane Placco, Fox 32 Chicago.